Hi guys, today on uh, Milmac TV we have Stefan Lustrum, have a look for regional sales at BA Systems, who will tell us everything about the Puffers 57mm naval gun system. Stefan, what could you tell us about this gun in terms of a general description? Well, what we're showing here is the Bofors 57mm Mark III naval gun system. That gun, together with the programmable ammunition we have called 3P, gives the system an all-target capability, basically. So, you mean you use the cannon, you use the ammunition for different targets, like surface targets, air targets, or land targets. What kind, what class of vessels could this gun be fitted in? This gun can be fitted on different classes of vessels. Uh, up till uh, now, we have sold the guns to a number of different countries. US Navy used them on their Litoli combat ships. US Coast Guard used them as well. Canada used them on their big frigates. That's the biggest vessel so far that has, has been equipped with this gun. It can also be fitted on smaller platforms. And actually, the Swedish Navy in the past had some legacy 57mm guns on platforms as small as 40 meters. So it's a very versatile gun. It can be fitted on different platforms. The usual setup is for OPVs, Corvettes, up to frigate size war vessels. Since you're promoting this design in Poland, which Polish Navy's modernization programs or procurement programs you're lo looking at in terms of the gun? Primarily now, we are in discussion with the Polish authorities and PGZ regarding the upgrade program for the Orton class Corvettes, the three vessels. Of course, in the long run, we are also interested to offer those guns for the modernization of new ships like Mierschnik, for example. Uh, what is your offer from Poland for Poland in terms of not only the naval system, the gun system, but also the maintenance, training and, and logistical support throughout the, the whole life cycle? Yeah, part of that discussion that we have right now with PGZ include offering also full maintenance capability to be transferred from Sweden to Poland to be done for the Polish guns here in Poland locally. Uh, we also have some Polish content. All the cablings and harnesses so far is produced in Poland by Hobia Cable. Uh, not only for the guns that we offer for the Polish Navy, but for all the 57mm guns that we produce today. Uh, do you foresee any options for partnering in, with Polish defense industry in terms of manufacturing of the gun? Uh, yes and no. We have looked at that in the past. Uh, it doesn't make business sense to do that for a smaller program, a smaller number of guns basically. It will cost too much. But in principle, yes, we are, can do that. We have done it in other markets with other customers. Okay. So the last question. Uh, you have lately won the, an, another contract for the German Navy. Could you elaborate a little bit on this topic? Yeah, sure, absolutely. We are very pleased to announce recently the contract award with Germany. So the German Bundespolizei, uh, German Federal Police, opted for a 57mm gun for their new patrol vessels. So that's three new vessels that's going to be equipped with the Bofors 57mm gun and a fire control system. Um, so this is a major breakthrough for, for Bofors uh, BA systems on the naval gun market in continental Europe. Are there any uh, procurement programs Europe-wide which you're looking now in terms of the, this gun? Absolutely, yeah. We're pursuing now a number of business opportunities in Europe for this gun system. Uh, so it looks very good, very positive. We see a trend, a very positive trend right now with increasing interest in the 57mm gun, but also our 40mm naval guns. So we could expect another contract being signed very shortly? Uh, that's what I hope for, yes. And this is what we wish for you. Thank you all for, for watching. This was all for the Milmec TV.